You're killing my killy killy. <laughs> What's going on in Bon? Your Pinoy Boy Mikey Bustos here and welcome to the Pinoy Boy channel again for another day. You might be wondering what is that noise? That's what it is. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> Inhale. <laughs> this is Sarah and Hi. no she's not body sculpting me this is out this is called yoga therapy yes because Mikey's thighs are getting tired oh. I okay yes very intense like this one ah! <laughs> <laughs> no, the feeling should be masakit na masarap. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is abusive. <laughs> abusive na masarap. I'm labor now. Yeah. Now I know what it is like for you ladies giving birth. <laughs> what does this do? This yoga therapy. Oh, this one loosens up your high areas. Oh. From your gym workouts, if you're always in beast mode, ah. mm. it feels like a beast is breaking my bones. And so far, I'm the only one who's been practicing it here in the Philippines. Wow! And the name of the yoga therapy is? This is yoga therapy based on toxin. These are my toxin tools. You talk, talk, the energy lines of my key. Toxin. Yes. Ah. Ow. And this is compression technique based on a northern style of Thai massage. <laughs> this is Thai pala. I, I, I can't feel my legs now. But I know afterwards it will feel good. Yes, it feels like a jellyfish. Does a jellyfish feel in pain 24-7? Or a boneless bangus. Bone bon <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what I feel like right now. Like in ah. You're killing my killy killy. I'm just holding your armpit. I'm just holding your killy killy. You're turning my armpit into an arm crater. So Sarah, you had to travel all the way to Thailand to learn this, right? Yes, with the master. Who was your master? It's Master Pashek. Ooh. And you're going to India soon. Yes, to study another technique for you. Wow. <laughs> it's called? Ayurveda. Ayurveda. Sarah, where can people get in touch with you if they want yoga therapy? Oh, they can message me on my FB page, The Yoga Drive Project. <laughs> and I'll leave the info in the description box. So be sure to contact Sarah. Namaste. If you need help with your body. Therapies. Ah, ah, I feel like an insect. Ah, 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 ah. Oh. Ah. Aren't we a little bit too old for piggyback rides? Ah, ah. <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to know what that belt is for. What is ah, ah This is not yoga, this is 50 shades. <laughs> RJ, why are you laughing? It's not funny. Oh my. Where are these straps go? <laughs> This is some twisted stuff. I thought yoga was supposed to be relaxing. <laughs> oh, this is interesting. Oh wow, this feels good. This is the good part. Yes. <laughs> this is the finale. <laughs> this is the finale. <laughs> Quite nice. And it smells good. What is that bit? It's peppermint. Oh, it's done guys. Thank you, Sarah. Yay. 
Thanks, Mikey. Oh. Yes, I feel great now. Thank you. You're a new person. I'm definitely a new person. <laughs> Guys, by the way, here we are in RJ's Apple Drive office. For those of you who don't know, RJ is involved in a charity. It's his charity called the Apple Drive Project. We're doing Apple Drive on February 14th. Valentine Apple Drive. Awesome. So they can help. There's the mission to create sustainable programs about healthy lifestyle and proper nutrition with underprivileged communities in the Philippines. It's nice. So check that out. So RJ, what's our schedule today? Besides our 1,182 emails <laughs> and internet work, what else do we have to do today? We have something with visitors here tonight at Ascot Hotel in BGC. Ooh, Ascot Hotel? That's yeah. nice. That's a nice event. Yeah, our, our like warm visitors of Europe are coming here tonight. Ooh, great! I love the folks over at the Guam Visitors Bureau. I love Guam. Do you guys know Guam? Have you been to Guam? Oh my gosh, half a day all of you people from Guam watching. So Mikey will pick you up at 5 p.m. because I still need to go to Mega Mall to fix my camera. What do you mean fix the camera? Uh, my camera holder is broken so I need to fix it for our trip. Why do we need to fix the camera? Well, well, I need it for, for photos in, in, on Sunday, this weekend. This weekend? You mean our mysterious destination? <laughs> yeah. <gasps> How strange! Good, good photos. What? Guys, for those of you who didn't watch yesterday, apparently we're heading somewhere, I don't know where, tomorrow night, like at midnight actually. And we've been trying to figure out where it is, but RJ doesn't want to say, and apparently it's with other people or someone else. And now he, he's got to fix the camera bag because he wants to take professional photos. <laughs> No, I'm really curious. Where is it? Where are we going? Why are we fixing my camera? Well, I just need good photos, Mikey. Hmm. Seems kind of fishy, don't you think? Don't you think it's kind of fishy? Where are we going tomorrow? Tomorrow? What? Tomorrow night. Tomorrow night? After midnight. No. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Well, I have no idea where. Some of you guys made some suggestions in the comment section of our last video as to where it might be. Um, and let's see if some of you guys are right. I don't know, some of you had some really cool guesses. And why do we have to use the professional camera? Why isn't this new vlogging camera good enough to take photos in this new place? Well, I find this one's better. It, it, takes, it takes good photos. Guys, just so you know, this is so weird that RJ is like wanting to take photos. So now I'm really curious <laughs> where we're going. All right, we're on our way to this event for GVB, the Guam Visitors Bureau, mm -hmm. right? Really excited to see these folks again because we work closely with Guam, right? Mm -hmm. uh, with the Guam's Visitors Bureau. We did videos for them. Yeah, our very first project was shopping. My baby is epic while shopping And she has no shame when she's asking for A discount in every single store Which was to promote the Guam Shopping Festival, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I, we really, really love Guam. I, I know I keep raving about Guam. <laughs> if you guys follow my Facebook page, you know how many Guam posts I make. Um, and that's really from the, just the joy in my heart that I have for the island of Guam. The last time we were in Guam, we did a concert, right? And um, I think it was like three days before we had only sold 300 tickets 300 tickets like it, um, Maybe just pe people hadn't heard that I was performing there. I don't know But the venue was what almost 2,000 mm -hmm. 1,800 or so So I did one radio appearance talking about the concert and then half an hour before the show when we arrived there There was a huge lineup that went all the way around the building and it turned out to be a sold-out show which was just unbelievable. You know, the love we get from Guam is just so great. Uh, for all of you guys there in Guam, have a day. Um, and we might be going to Guam. I'm not sure about it. Please. I yeah, will try. Just like two or three days. Okay, we'll try. Yeah, well, I want to take you guys to Guam. Oh my gosh. I feel like people need to know more about this island. It's, I love the Philippines, right? Okay, let's put Philippines aside. Guam is my number one favorite place in the world. Mm -hmm. Next to Kota Kinabalu <laughs> and Toronto, of course. 
Uh, but yeah, Guam is just so beautiful, and I hope you guys get to uh, get to experience it. And I hope we get to go Ooh, sometime this month. My body feels really good. That that yoga. Did you like it? I did. Sarah is really good. It hurts <laughs> during the process, but then afterwards, it feels really good. You experience the benefits. Yeah, I tried to do, to do the, the therapy twice a month. Here we are at Ascot Hotel. Isn't it beautiful? Look at that. Such a nice hotel. I want to live here. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Guys, this, this is Carmel. Okay. We, we have so many friends here yes. from, from Guam. Your name is? I'm Regina. Regina. Big fan of Mikey. Thank you. And are you Filipino or Chamorro? I'm Chamorro. Oh, awesome. So Micronesian. Chamorro Micronesian. Micronesian. That's yes. right. So people from Guam are called Chamorro. Chamorros, mm -hmm. yes. Chamorros, that's Chamorros. right. And, and Chamorros are very similar to Filipinos because they like taking selfies. Smile. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks Thank for you. coming, Mikey. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, guys, I've got a special someone here, a very good friend of mine now. Her name is Ma'am Pilar from Guam, and she is the global director of marketing. Correct? You got that. Of the Guam Visitors Bureau. We have worked together now for how many years? It's been like two years yes, now. Yes, a couple of years. And thank you for helping uh, Branding Guam as the premier shopping destination oh. here in Asia. Thank you. You know what? We love Guam so much. And we hope to be there soon. Right? Why are you pointing at me? Because you love Guam so much. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I thought I was in trouble. I wanted to ask, what exciting things can we expect from Guam Visitors Bureau and Guam this year? Well, it's the year of love and we're about to just showcase to everybody the many wonderful things that you can do on Guam like love shopping, of course we all know that, but we have love scuba diving, we're going to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the SMS Cormoran, April 7th. We have the United uh, Marathon Run on Guam on April 9th. Uh, we have smoking wheels if you like racing. Uh, we have uh, our Guam Micronesian Island Fair coming up in May. Oh, I hear that's so exciting. It is really exciting. You should that. come. You should I know come. I want to. Maybe we could get you. RJ, make Marco. it happen. <laughs> Yes, you know, last year we hosted the Festival of the Pacific Arts, so everyone really gravitated to learning and enjoying cultures from throughout the Pacific. So we're going to feature Guam and all of Micronesia and our brothers and sisters in the rest of the Pacific region that we can attract. So awesome. we hope everybody comes out for that. It'll be great. five days, so there's no excuse not to come. That's right. It's really great. And you know, I think Disney did a great thing with the movie Moana. Oh, yes. With featuring like Pacific Island you culture. Can See all the culture and just with the tattoo on the, the the characters and their costumes and the vegetation and the beauty of the island. Awesome. It really helped all of our islands in the Pacific. That's great. Yes. Thank you. I'm really excited for today's press conference. Oh well thank you and half a day from Guam. Alright. Oh my god, I'm such a nerd guys. I see succulents. I love this centerpiece. I want to take it home for my ants. <laughs> oh. Very intimate with that plant. Yeah. I certainly plant love plants. Let's hear you say Papa Day. Papa in Rome we say Papa Day.
All right, that was a fun event, right? Yeah, I enjoyed it. Man, you know what? So much love for Guam. RJ, make it happen. Guam trip, three days. I think I'll, we'll, we can do it. Don't think, just make. Thanks guys for joining us on another full pack day. Um, we have another full day tomorrow and I can't wait to find out where this mysterious place we're going is. So tune in tomorrow guys. Love you, bye. Mm. My lips are dry, my lips are so dry.